In this video, we're going to look at a sample set of data. For each user, we have a product ID, and we need to get the friendly product name so we can read it easier. In this sheet, we have the product IDs and the product names. In our user sheet, I've added a new column for product name. To start the formula, we'll do equals VLOOKUP, and you can hit tab on the keyboard to enter the function. Next, we need the reference value, which is the product ID, comma. If we go to our product sheet, we can select the range of data we're going to be scanning, which is column A, row 2 through B, 17. Do a comma and it's going to check next the column index number. We have two columns. So we're going to do two. And we do want an exact match, so we're going to do comma false. And hit return. This is a small set of data, but if we go ahead and pull down the handle, you'll see as we've done that, this range changes. So we really only want a2 through B17. We don't want that to be dynamic or we'll be missing values in this case. So we need to make this range absolute by doing a dollar sign after the column letter and we do still want our reference number to be dynamic and change. In this instance, we've got a product ID that is not included and we're getting an error value. To solve that, we need to do an if statement. So at the beginning of the formula, we'll type equals if error, open parentheses, and we need to close the parentheses at the end. Before that last parentheses, we're going to do a comma and two quotes. So what this is saying is, if there's a value, leave a blank cell. So now you can see it's not an in, in a value or a zero. So if we go back to our table, we can see, check another one of these on down, 12, correct and everything appears to be matched up now. If we don't want this formula to stay you can copy your entire column now copy and you can paste the values. If you go to paste special you can paste in just the values and now I'm just going to cut them and replace this list. So highlighting again, this is our formula for pulling the product ID from another sheet and getting the friendly name. If this video helped you out, please like the video and subscribe. Thanks for watching.